Oh, Harry, stick it. Oh, yeah? Press that button. You do that one more time, honey, and I'm going to bite you. Oh, yeah? Press that button. Did you get... There you go. Get it! Get it! Don't touch it! Why, you Birdman? Did you get that thing? I'll take the case. I've already taken the case. Get off my wing! I'll take the case. I've already taken the case. Get off my wing! Mmm. 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 Oops, <laughs> that's not what I meant to present the court. Wrong thing, wrong thing. You never admitted that to anyone before. And it's on record. Gigi, wife. Uh, not while I'm under oath, Harry. Wrong item. <laughs> Wrong time. You never admitted that to anyone before. And it's on record. Gigi, wife. Uh, not while I'm under oath, Harry. Mm. This matchbook, found at the scene of the crime, uh, my house. Sure, looks like a matchbook to me. Don't you find it strange that my client would put his own name and phone number on the very matches he used to burn my house and leave them there for all to find? Uh, not really. He was probably going to give them to some intern. Nah, I was going to give them to Savannah over at Boobies. Ah-ha! Uh -huh. Ixnay on the Atches, May. No, I mean I was gonna give him to Savannah until I saw... Gigi! I gave him to her at the weenie roast at your place, Birdman. She asked for him, and I, being a gentleman, obliged. Plus, it's not like I could ever use him without thumbs at all. So that does place Gigi at the scene of the crime with the Book of Matches. Wait, but why? Bird girl to the rescue! I found a new piece of evidence. <gasps> it's a cigarette lighter with the initials PP engraved on the side. I found it at your house, Birdman. Oh, thanks for that evidence. That's great. For the other side, a cigarette lighter with Mr. Potamus's initials on it at the scene of the conflagration. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, I believe that this is what we refer to as... A smoking gun. Or some people I know call it a lighter. Hmm. Something here just doesn't make sense. Did you get that thing that I sent to you?
Uh, did she say she was my wife again? Because maybe she could help me with that seven-letter word. Would the witness please rephrase her testimony for the court? I can change my testimony. I pulled up in front of our place and saw Petey. Whatever. He was lighting a fire by the front door using that lighter. I drove off to get help from my precious husband, Harry. Wrong item. Wrong time. Oh? Where did you drive for help? I drove down the street and dialed 911 on my cell phone. I can't believe I processed incriminating evidence against Birdman's client. Now there's no way Birdman can win this case on his own. He needs me and the Bird team now more than ever. I will make up for this, but how? How? Oh, sorry. I know! 911! That's it! I'll get the recording and we'll find out her story doesn't check and I will save this case! To the burglar! <laughs> This will do it, Birdman! I found new evidence which will convict Potamus for good! I mean, Gigi. Thanks, I think. Hey, there's like a duplex on fire. Oh, okay, what is the address? Hmm, I'm not really sure. But it belongs to Birdman. Uh, okay, ma'am. Will that be a Henry or Harvey Birdman? Oh, it's Harry. Oh. Okay, well, according to our directory, there are no Harry Birdmans in the area. I'm sorry, is this Gigi? Yeah. Hi, it's me, Scott. Hey, you. How you doing? I didn't know you were working tonight. Yeah, only a few more hours. I'll see you later. <laughs> yeah, you will. I would beg to differ with this statement, but I think it sounds just fine. Yeah, nothing looks out of place here. You're backing up the wrong tree, Birdman. This evidence says you made the call at 12.30 a.m. That's exactly an hour and a half after you said you saw Potamus setting the fire. Well, here's what happened. I drove to the birdcage to see if you were there. You weren't, but there was this suspicious guy with an eye patch who I flirted with. I mean, watched for like an hour because I thought he had something to do with the fire. He didn't. Then I drove to Peanut's house to see if he was awake. He was. Or at least he was by the time I left. Oh. And that is when I called 911 to report the fire. So you pretty much let my house burn down? All my stuff gone? My Bell Biv Devo collection? My coupons? The thing I sent him? That thing he sent me? Y Wait, what thing? A prenuptial agreement between Harvey and Gigi saying she gets half of any insurance claim? What? Wait! There's the motive! So, seeing as you don't keep track of things I send to you, I brought a copy with me. You may 
may have motive and access to the crime scene and a reasonable time frame and opportunity. But I have proven that the fire was started with Potamus's engraved lighter. That lighter is integral to winning this case. So you are telling the court that the owner of the lighter is the arsonist. Isn't that right, Volturo? I'm sure if I handed this lighter to Potamus, there would be no way he could make it work. Harvey, I may not have fingers, but I am able to perform many complicated tasks. Give me that thing! Hey, everyone, look! A sandwich! I got it! I got it! <sighs> Have you attempted to use the lighter? <laughs> this is nothing more than one of those trick lighters that squirt water. Here, let me show the court. Uh, so, as you can plainly see, that man is on fire. And uh, therefore, this is not a trick lighter. While these may appear to be Peter Potamus's initials engraved on the lighter, if you flip it over, tilt it at a 90 degree angle while gleaming it towards the sun and possibly wear an eye patch, the initials clearly read GG. By the great god of horn gods, I declare this case over. <laughs> I can't believe it. We won! See? I told you we could do it! We won! We won! So, who won? Eeny, meeny, miny, birdman. Well, Potamus, it looks like I'll have to crash at your place for a while. Sure, but you have all that insurance money coming to you. Too bad Gigi gets half. Actually, <laughs> I get all of it. It turns out, Harry Birdman signed this prenuptial agreement, and I would like to take this time to tell everyone that I am not Harry. Ha ha ha! Quadruple entendre! At least in French it is! <laughs> <laughs> I'll take the case. I'll take the case. I'll take the case. Say you'll take the case. I'll 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 take the bet. I'll take the case. I'll take the case. Oh, I'll take the case. I'll take the case. I'll take the case. Well, of course, devoting full attention to your, um, case. I'll take the case! He'll take the case! Damn right, he damn well, damn it. 